everyone, it's Yoslin and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing a chit chat get ready with me. I did this makeup look as you guys can see. I showed you guys some of the products that I used and also just talked about some stuff that's been going on recently. And also a lot of the products I use to get this makeup look are by Merit. really like their makeup. So if you guys want to check them out, I'll have a link in my description. But anyways, if you guys want to see how I did this look, then just keep on Start off with my makeup. I have it all inside this bag. I put these clips in my hair. I have been breaking out as you guys can see. You guys can still see some blemishes that i have i'm gonna use this i really like this it's a serum i put like a pump and a half and then i pat it into my skin and then i go in with sunscreen every day i use sunscreen here it is i use my two fingers like that to measure i see how like glowy that makes my skin look though i honestly don't know the order you're supposed to be putting these things in like moisturizer sunscreen all that I kind of just do what works for me. The matte primer, so I'm gonna use this. I don't usually use this, but today I am. I'm just gonna put it in these three spots. I don't know if I was supposed to do this before. I feel like I was. I'm gonna go in with this Kale's eye treatment for under the eyes. So for concealer, this is what I use all over my face. This is the Merit Complexion Stick. I have the shade Suede, in case you guys are wondering what shade I am. And here it is, as you guys can see. So, yeah, I kind of, like, try to spot where I want it to go. And then if it doesn't get covered the first time, I just layer it. It's really creamy, so it blends out nicely. I go in with the Merit brush. This is my favorite brush. I've talked about it in so many videos, and I blend this out. Anyways, I tried making matcha the other day. I posted it on my Instagram story. If you guys don't have me on Instagram, you definitely should. My Instagram's at BNA Moda. It's the same as my YouTube channel. I tried, like, making it four times. But the thing is, I don't know what matcha is supposed to taste like. So, I'm making it, but I'm like... Because I see so many different recipes on TikTok. And I've tried them, but they all just kind of taste the same. So, I'm like, I don't know. I need to go to the store and buy the whisk. Because I don't have that. But yeah, I asked you guys on my Instagram if you've had matcha. And actually, surprisingly, the majority of you guys have not had matcha, but it was like already pre-made. And you would just add milk to it. It's not the same as when you buy powdered matcha. I'm gonna add a bit more because you can add more coverage. Before I blend it out, I'm gonna let it sit for a bit. So I'm just gonna leave it there. I'm gonna go in under my eyes. I still use three concealers. So I'm gonna go in with these two. For my base, I like using one specific type of concealer and then under my eyes, I always use two. I'm gonna blend this out now. Under my eyes, it's like a whole completely different thing. I use a beauty blender and I blend it out and I blend it outwards. Now I'm gonna go in with the powder. This is actually not the powder that's inside this. I crumbled up the powder and put it in here. I go in with this little thing and I just pat it and I get like really shiny throughout the day. I go in with a lot of powder. It doesn't really matter if my face, if my skin is matte right now because later in the day, it's not gonna be. Now I'm gonna go in with bronzer. I use this brush. I love the look of bronzer, so I put a lot of it on. I just put this here. Oh, this looks really harsh, but I'm gonna blend this out. It looks a little bit harsher on camera, but it also looks weird because I haven't done any other bronzers. So I'm gonna do my cheekbones, and then I very gently blend up. This is actually my bad side, this side right here. So that's why the camera's on this side, because this is my good side. I forgot, I do bronzer on my nose. This is like a really in-depth tutorial. But I go like this. Oh, that was a lot. I did not mean to put that much. But I go like this, and then I blend it out. I'm really excited for summer. I want it to be summer already. I uploaded one DIY video. Okay, I think I blended that out pretty good. As I was saying, I feel like it's really odd doing DIY videos when it's not really summer yet. But I want to start doing them, but it's just... Like, the weather's not giving summer. I go in with a powder bronzer after that, so I just go in with this one. Because I feel like it needs to be set. Now for the cream blush, I'm going to go in with this Merit one. This is in the shade Cheeky. I love this color. I'm really into colors like these. I'm going to put it on my cheek. When I add this onto my cheek, I kind of focus it more over here. I blend it out with my hands. There's one side. I'm going to do the other one. Spring starts the 20th. I think it's coming up not looking like spring where I live. It's well, I actually say it's kind of sunny, which is surprising, but it's been raining a lot. I don't like the rain. Going with powdered blush, this is the one I use. I use this as eyeshadow. 
I don't like how bronzer looks on me as eyeshadow, so I just use blush. Now we have a lot of blush on. That's how I like it. Okay, I'm gonna do my eyebrows. You just brush them up and I follow the shape that I have. I don't really know about spring. Like, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I don't remember what spring is like. I'm excited for summer because I want to go swimming and I just like the weather. And I like dressing for the weather a lot. Although I do like wearing sweaters, last year for the winter time, I was just wearing like crew necks and sweatpants like every day. But this time I actually bought like knitted sweaters. Improvement on that part. My eyebrows have always been different. I try making them as similar as possible, but they've always been different. So yeah, but I try making them look alike. Now I'm gonna go in with the brow gel. I actually bought this and I didn't like it, but then I tried it again and I liked it. So yeah, now I use it. You guys can see it in the mirror. I have a mirror on the other side. I can only do my eyeliner looking into that mirror. It's really weird. I don't know why. I struggle doing my eyeliner anywhere else, but I'm going to do my eyeliner over there. Okay, I did it. This is the fastest I've ever done my eyeliner. I'm like so happy with that. I'm going to curl my eyelashes first. This is the most important step. I honestly feel like my makeup isn't complete without mascara. I was listening to Gracie Abrams. I listened to her whole album. My favorite song on the album is I Should Hate You. I also like Best. That one's one of my favorites too. Well, I do two coats of mascara, but I'm gonna let that one dry first. I'm gonna line my lips with lip liner. I really like lipstick, so I'm excited to try that. And I'll show you guys how it looks. So I lined my lips. Let me do my second coat of mascara before I do this. I'm also going on vacation really soon. Well, hopefully I do go, because it depends on the weather. I'm definitely gonna do a vlog. Because I have not been on vacation in a while. Here it is. It's still in the packaging. Merit lipstick in the shade Baby. But I just started getting into lipstick recently. Because I used to not wear it. Like the past six months probably, I'd say, I started getting into lipstick. Here it is. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It's Merit in the gold packaging. Oh my gosh, I love their packaging. Okay, I'm going to put this on. Okay, there it is. I kind of messed up, so I'm going to clean up the edges because I kind of went outside the line. But this is a really pretty color. I was looking for a color kind of like this. I kind of went outside the line, so let me fix that. I'm going to be taking this on vacation with me. It's really nice. I wanted a color that was kind of like my lip color but better, if that makes sense. Yeah, okay, I'm going to let the mascara dry a bit because it has to dry before I take it off of my eyelids. Let me take this mascara off. Yeah, I'm gonna put more blush on my eyelids right now because I took them all off with this makeup remover to get the mascara off. I'm just gonna get it on my finger. I'm not gonna put it on my eyelid. Put it a little bit higher than I usually go. A lot of these products that I used were Merit because they have really good products. If you order from Merit, you get their signature bag with your first purchase. This is mine. It has my makeup inside of it. You also get free shipping when you spend $40. If you guys see me using any of their products and you like it and you want to try them out, then I'll have the link in my description down below. So this is the finished makeup. This was kind of just like a random chit chat video because I kind of just talked about random things, but hopefully you guys still enjoyed watching it. And if you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!